Welcome back. Well, if you are looking for a secure technology, no matter if it's a phone, tablet, or POS, look no further than TazTag. I'm here with Michelle, and Michelle, I tell you what, TazTag has always been leading the way, and today's no different. Tell us a little bit about what we have here. Ah, what we have is the outcome of, as you just say, we know each other since a while, so it's the outcome of uh, several years developing what the market is really wanting to have. Uh, again, as a reminder, it's always B2B devices and it's always secure mobile devices. That's really our expertise. We started long, long ago with NFC and secure elements, e-wallet ideas. Now we have uh, the, the, the ultimate, uh, what's called KYC, Know Your Customer okay. Terminal meant for customer onboarding. Uh, we've got uh, mobile POS, I do, as you just said. Uh, they, they, they are absolutely uh, also, once more, unique with fingerprint. We are uh, integrating iris recognition, so not only finger uh, now biometric, but also iris. Uh, the phone here uh, is a secure mobile phone, uh, government grade. Uh, it's really secured with hardware and software, not security based on software only. It's really based on uh, hardware security. When we power up the phone, we start checking that nothing has changed in it. And uh, that's really the first thing before starting any OS. So it's really that kind of security we are in. Wow. And really, your security has so many different types of applications that if there's somebody out there that really wants something tailored to their needs, you can accommodate. Sure. So. Um, I think I, I, I would picture you uh, what is the, the ideal use case uh, which is deployed today in the Gulf area uh, in the uh, United Arab Emirates. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a cell that's interesting uh, which has been deployed uh, this summer, 2014, and it started here January 14th. Oh, is that right? After we discussed together, wow. that's that's funny. So this uh, device was at this time a prototype. Now it's a commercial device. It's deployed in thousand units. What do they use it for? Uh, this is for a telco, and this telco is issuing new SIM cards to customers, but only with biometric recognition. That's part of the, their regulation. In okay. like many emerging countries now are working this way, and they wanted something to be able to do in one only device all the information uh, uh, acquisition uh, to make sure that they've got everything about the customer to sell, send to the back end, control and send back an activation code for the SIM card. They do it with the device. Uh, all of the sensors and slots are available. You can, if you picture it, that's amazing. They can read passports, the OCR, you know, uh, characters right. on a passport, on any ID card, Mac Stripe they can read, right. smart card reading with chip and pin. Uh, as you can see, there is optical fingerprint. You can read, you know us, it's contactless, so we know NFC, it's part of our expertise. Of course, you can read NFC card, NFC passports, and you can sign on the screen. Uh, you can grab high quality picture for uh, face recognition, for instance. Oh, yeah. Not only this, but it's also, uh, I would say, the ultimate mobile device because you've got two batteries, including one hot swappable. So you can really oh, never okay. stop the device right. if you want to. Yeah. That's part of the thing we provide to customers. That is just amazing. Everything that you mentioned there really is going to allow them, no matter what they encounter, to be able to use the data. Absolutely. Absolutely. Especially uh, when you uh, think about countries where you've got not that much infrastructure. You want to be mobile. You want to have access online, offline, depending on where you are. Could be a small city, a village, your own car, a kiosk that you create on the right. spot. I mean, that's, that's what they need to make it happen. Yeah. Cities, village, you can address anything. The good thing is that based on this, it started with telco, and now we're discussing also with banking, because mobile banking is a big thing. Sure, and everybody's afraid about, uh, you know, how secure is Absolutely. my data. Absolutely, you know, you know that, so that's part <laughs> of our expertise. And this is why this got this uh, secure phone. The phone here, I would not do a long demonstration uh, while we are shooting this, but uh, we have um, here at, uh, at the CES uh, and more at MWC, we are unveiling a new full suite, security suite that you can have on your phone. The idea is that uh, this secure phone is secure hardware and software, as I was explaining. Right. So now we have this phone that you can, depending on this security suite, if you will, you can adapt on a B2C standard phone, the one you've got in your pocket or myself, typical one. Uh, and that would be one level of security, but it's only software. So uh, we will definitely secure uh, mail and voice and data communication. Now, if you want to go to really the, up the scale to the highest level of security, you need hardware plus hardware. software. Then you will use our phone 
and the same security suite, and you will have the maximum level of security. That would be the idea. Well, this is really the age of TazTag because security is in everybody's mind. You know, banking, uh, transporting, uh, airlines, etc. In fact, uh, after I saw you last year, we went to the UAE in March, and I was surprised at their level of security. So much higher than the United States, you know. Uh, but with good reason, and uh, it's nice to see that there's technology out there that's going to provide the information everyone needs to feel secure at the end of the day. Absolutely, and uh, as you just mentioned uh, UAE, and it's true, we are going uh, to uh, JITEX every year in Dubai. Uh, we are, so this is the CS equivalent show over there. Right. We're going to uh, Milipol, which is a vertical security show okay. uh, for military and police. We're going to CART, which is you know cards and payment. All of these uh, markets need uh, this high level of security. So there are many players. The good news for us, I'm often, you know, uh, uh, there is often a question about uh, what's your competition. So uh, the good news is that uh, we are always in advance on everyone. And the thing is that even uh, the, the, the the big brands providing uh, secure solution, full solution, right. they buy from us. That's great. I won't name Nebi here, but they buy from us. So that's a good news. That's very good news. <laughs> well, we have a company that has a total secure solution, uh, steeped in technology, and all across all platforms. And Michelle, with that said right now, I know you have to have the attention. All of our viewers out there, what's the best way for them to learn more and partner with you about all of their devices? Um, again, one more news. We have a brand new website. We oh, just okay. uh, you know, uh, uh, made it public uh, before the CES. Okay. So they can go to taztag.com, T-A-Z-T-A-G.com. They will see the brand new website. They've got all the information for, for, for this and all the contact information. Contact at taztag.com. That's us. Any yeah. question, let us know. Easy enough, Michelle. Thanks again for being on. Thanks to you. Thanks.